530. Imagine losing your iPhone, not just around the house, but in the ocean. Imagine how surprising it would be to actually get it back covered in barnacles. WPTV South County reporter Miranda Christian explains how in the world this happened. This is not the catch Marshall Sklar expected while diving for lobsters after Hurricane Dorian. It was 40 feet of water. He found this iPhone off the coast of Pompano Beach. Couldn't tell what kind it was. Covered in barnacles and not working. There was only one clue to its owner. And behind the case, there was a fishing license. And the fishing license was in pristine condition. So Sklar posted on Facebook, searching for the owner. I only had it for two weeks. The power of social media did its thing. But I think it looks fantastic. The phone belongs to Carmen Miranda. Home button doesn't work though. What's crazy is Miranda lost the phone more than a year ago. June of 2018. He lost the phone 20 miles from where Sklar found it. I would lost it around Hollywood in about 60 feet of water. So it had a year and a half to bury itself in the sand or in the reef and somehow it ended up right in front of me. Miranda surprised Sklar with his favorite drink to say thank you. It's a lobster magnet, maybe. The phone still has some leftover growth from the ocean. I was going to call Apple and say, hey, I don't know what happened to my phone. Just stop working. Instead, Miranda will keep it for a good story to tell about an iPhone, a fishing license, and the power of social media. In Boca Raton, I'm Miranda Christian, WPTV News Channel 5. Great to hear Apple's response about, about the barnacles. <laughs> Amazing. The barnacles on the phone. Absolutely fantastic story, Miranda. And if